What is it like to be branded as killers? These people know. We're in a United Nations refugee transit camp in Goma, in the Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo. They are all Rwandan Hutus who fled in 1994 following the victory of the invading Tutsi-led rebel force, the RPF. They were joined by the Hutu power extremists who were responsible for the Rwandan genocide earlier that year, in which an estimated 800,000 people, mostly Tutsis, were killed. Tomorrow, after more than 15 years, these people are going home, and I'm here to join one of them and experience with them the journey they are about to make, to understand what it's like for these people to return to Rwanda after those fateful few months of 1994. These people have been living in exile, side by side with the very people who are responsible for the genocide, the Interahamwe, who are still out there fighting and are still a threat to the Rwandan government. For 15 years, many of these people have been living in terrible conditions in the forest of the Congo, constantly moving. So why now, after all these years, are they deciding to go, to return to Rwanda?